Hi Sajal here and we are solving knocker 0012 CFD as a fully turbulent case and the purpose of this lecture is to export the CP plot from the fluent and then plot the same plot in the Excel and then change the y axis upside down as shown in the CP plot of the NASA data and which is common in the all data we see on the internet about the arrow files or the wings. The reason is very simple is that on the upper side which you see here this, this graph this is the region where we have the leading edge and here is the region where we have the trailing edge of the arrow file or the wing and the upper side is the basically in the in this graph is basically is the upper side of the arrow file and this the second plot which is the the cb plot on the on the bottom side of the arrow file here we have the graph from the cfd and this is basically is is the bottom side which is being shown on the on the top side so from the common sense point of view it is very common in the literature that the we should be plotting the data in a way so that the we have the CV plot on the upper side should be on the upper side and the, on the bottom side they should be on the lower side. This is the reason that we are going to upside down the y-axis. And here is the fluent open with the NACA 0012 CFD with a fine mesh at the 10 degree angle of attack. First we plot the CP plot on the arrow file which is shown in this figure. Second thing is that click on the write to file and enable the option. And after that you will you will see that the instead of the show or the plot we will have the write option so click on write and put the file name let's say cp underscore angle of attack 10 click on ok and then open the excel and go to data for data and then open the excel and then open the excel and go to the data menu and from data menu click on get external data and choose option from the text file click on d drive and click on the all files from the field and search for the cp plot cp underscore angle of vertex 10 the same file we wrote from the fluent and then click on the import click on next and uh, by default we have the delimiter of the tab option enabled and if you look at the data they are separated by the column so click on next and finish ok and now select this data the whole data and then go to the insert and then go to the scattered display and then right click on the y axis and click on format axis and then click on the values in the reverse order this will reverse the order of the y axis on the chart and now you can change the different options on the chart so you can have the quick layout and right click on the graph and select data you can write down the CP NACA 0012 CP plot and angle of attack 10 so that we can differentiate the graph for the NACA 0012 CFD with data of the any other arrow file or the external data from the NASA ok And also you can change the axis location on the center for example for the x axis you can make it on the on the top side or the bottom side as your choice. So next to axis high this will make the on the on the very lowest position on the top side or you don't want to display the any any plot any data on the x axis so i would i would be preferring the 
the low or the maybe the high one option 